It's July 9th and we got a little bit of frost here in the garden. Not. Not. It's just cottonwood, the seeds that are falling out of the tree. This afternoon it looked like a blizzard out here. Still a little bit floating around, but not near like it was this afternoon. This is our late garden. It's pretty little green shoots coming up. And this is our earlier gardens. They're just beautiful. A little row of green beans out front here. Our potatoes are huge and beautiful. And our carrots. We have little baby broccoli coming. Today's the day. We're starting to build a chicken house. We got our runners cut this morning. We're gonna make it out of our cottonwood lumber. Val, did you tell them your plans? Uh, huh? Do they know how you're, they're supposed to build it? Yeah. Yeah. You can be left-handed maybe and do it. Last month, Matt and I went to a marketplace find and we got some sheeting. So we're going to use that for the floor. This morning, I went and found a window on marketplace. So between the sawmill and marketplace, we're going to have a bargain, a bargain chicken coop. So they're getting some stuff done there. I need to run up to Home Depot and see if I can get some remnant linoleum. It's a neighborhood affair over here. The mosquitoes are a bit thick this morning, so we've got hoods on. So it's Monday morning, July 10th, and we're going to feed the fishies a worm. I just called them fishies. <laughs> We're going to feed the chickies a worm. It's 55 degrees. They ate it. And got a washing machine I think I forgot to tell everybody about on Marketplace. So we're running laundry and building a chicken house. So this morning we're cleaning out the fridge and making a salad. Kate's cutting up a salad. And I am making a no bean bean dip. I think there's some. So what we're doing here, Mary, is we're gonna take and throw some screws in it to kinda get it started. <laughs> Put in place, and then Clayton's gonna grab the staple gun, and he's gonna nail everything. Gotta square it up already. So that's what we're You're gonna use air, the air gun? And we're gonna use the air nailer, that's correct. And you're gonna use nails, and then are you gonna take the screws out? No, we'll just leave them in. Not very many. It's, okay. Yeah, not very many. You just have the screws in there to hold it square. Just to get them all in place, and then that way we know it's where we want it. So because it's on these runners, does that mean there will be no joist hangers? Uh, let's see. So this is a chicken coop, so that's probably why there'll be no joist hangers. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Making progress. Yep.
Valerie made little roosting branches for these little hens and they love getting up there and roosting on them. They're so much fun and they're so cute. Well, it started raining, so Very much. we're taking a little break and eating our lunch. Thankfully, we have this big kitchen. <laughs> and we can get in out of the rain. Yeah. They won't fly out really, No, right? no. They, can. Oh, they get close, though. I think they can, but they choose not to. Right, Bill? Um, they could, yes, Ezra, you're right. Good job. Is it fun? Yeah. So you have one side well done. And you got a space for a window. Oh, the mosquitoes are buzzing out here. Are we going to put plywood on it now? Uh, no. Hey. How did she do it like... <laughs> That's all we did is... Okay, Valerie. Put about five in there. I'll left down there. Wait, how do they? Okay, now, no, wait, one more. Wait. Yep, one more. Oh, my goodness. It's nailed in here, and it's going to be nailed in here. You follow? Does that make sense, Val? Yep. Perfect. Good slam. Do it again. Is that Ezra's turn? Yeah. You can let Ezra do it. Five and a half. Who's mm -hmm. huh? <laughs> like... While my dad and the kids are up building the chicken house, Matt and I are down here playing with the sawmill. So we have the spruce log, that's a dead one, and we're going to cut it in half and see if we can make some steps or something out of it. Nice. Yeah. Matt and I were down by the sawmill and they came down to tell us that they needed help putting that wall up because they wanted to surprise us and show us that they had put up both walls. So we brought the lumber that Matt and I sawed up up here and we're making some shelves for the outdoor kitchen. I have these two boards. Mean, no. We did the live edges, and that's going to be the backsplash. And that's going to be the shelf, actually. And I sanded it down a little bit. So Matt's going to hang them up here soon. And Matt's going to put a shelf up right here. So he's building a template for it. in a circle.
You like it? Yep, I have to cut a little bit of an angle on this because that post is so mm -hmm. angled. So I either have to cut this on an angle or notch out that post. Yeah, cut that on an angle. So I'm gonna try to cut this on a little angle. That's gonna be not as much fun, but we'll see. Does that look high enough? Yeah. Right there. You ready? I'm ready. So we got that shelf put up, and then we got this shelf here put up. Turned out really nice, and I'm loving it. There goes Bill. This is rough cut material and this is not a perfectly straight edge. We need an eight foot board. We're gonna mark one inch. And then we're going down in this sand and we're gonna mark 97 inches. And we'll cut that inch off, we'll cut this inch off. We have an eight foot board that has square ends on it. So that's what we're gonna do here. Cut that. We're gonna cut that. One. That's the last one? Yeah. How many have you carried so far? Uh, and what is this for? Uh, no idea. I think it's for the siding. Probably. Maybe it's for the roof. <laughs> no, I think Tim is going to go on the roof. We're getting the rafters up. But right now they're squaring it up. Pretty nice work. So day two is winding down and we didn't get any rain today. And we got a lot done on the chicken coop. It's looking good in here. You guys being super helpful? Yep, definitely. Is it fun, Val? Uh, does this come out? Is it fun, Val? Me? Yeah. Yeah. I thought you said Dale. Oh, it does sound like Dale. I know. We're going to leave that on. I want to move the stage away for braces in. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. 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 Good. Looking good. He got his first hunt right. And a machete. And a machete. Now he can go fishing and hunting. That's three oh eight. That's a really nice gun case. That came ready. Yeah, came with the gun case. Gun. Full package. Gun case. Gun. Sling. It's got a nice oh. scope. Well, we are part way through day three, and now we're oh onto the siding. 
that's a long ways. It's looking good. Okay, so I gotta cut that off. What are you doing, Bao? Skinning carrots. You making supper with Grandma? Yeah. What's for supper? I don't know. <laughs> We're gonna make barley and vegetable soup. And what do you like doing better? Working on the chicken house or working on the chicken house. Making supper. Working on the chicken house. <laughs> How do you like camping out, Mom? Good. I love your outdoor kitchen. Oh, you do? I do. Good. We're making beef and what? Oh, it's beef vegetable with barley. So we're at the bottom side of day three and we are putting the tar paper on. To say day two, Mary, it makes you feel better. <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. Top side of day two. Well, For a retired person. Yeah, that's right. For I'd say that day three is pretty amazing. Yeah. Okay. It's, it's looking good. Day four. On the front here we did boards and we're going to put battens on but we haven't got that far yet and that's on the front and then over on the side and on this side we did cladboard siding and i'm really loving it it's really pretty wood it's our cottonwood from down by the river and so we're half done here the back is covered and we have the whole side over here that has to get done on the other side where the window goes and then this back half and we're gonna put a tin roof on. I already got half of this side tinned up. Okay. I'm glad you have the scaffolding, that's nice. Andy. Do you like that, Val? Yes, yeah, so fun. <laughs> Awesome. That gives us nice overlap there. Yeah. I see. I feel okay. I think I'm just gonna move my ladder on the end here. Valerie's up there doing the last row. Okay, now move just move slowly. Yep, just move across there. Okay. Yep. And then got a mosquito? Yeah, that's a heavy. That's a heavy log. <laughs> <laughs> 